हेलो एवरी वन वेलकम टू मैन एवर एजुकेशन एंड टूडे वी विल डिस्कस द वीकली करंट अफेयर ऑफ द वर्ल्ड दिस वीक फोर्थ वीक ऑफ अप्रैल 2022 थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी टू बट बिफोर वी गोइंग टू स्टार्ट आई वॉन्ट टू डिस्कस दैट इफ यू आर प्रिपेयरिंग फॉर द लो एंट्रेंस एम बी एंट्रेंस टीस एग्जामिशन गवर्मेंट बैंक एग्जामिशन एंड इफ यू आर ऑल्सो प्रिपेयरिंग फॉर बी बी ए होटल मैनेजमेंट बी एड एन एस एस सी जी एल सो डॉन्ट वरी मैन एवर एजुकेशन इज इयर एंड इफ यू आर इंटरेस्टेड फॉर दिस काइंड ऑफ द कोर्सेज सो गूगल फॉर्म लिंक इज अवेलेबल द डिस्क्रिप्शन वेर यू कैन फिल द फॉर्म वेर इजिली एज पर यू रिक्वायरमेंट एंड अवर काउंसलिंग टीम विल कॉन्टेक्ट यू एंड विल डेफिनेटली गाइड यू If you are the new family member of the Man of Education, so please subscribe our channel in the YouTube. We have also social media platform where you can get the regular updates. And if you are looking for the online and live classroom coaching, so just contact on eight eight two eight five one four five five. And if you are looking for classroom coaching at the Mumbai, so we have uh, three centers: Borivali, Vasai, and the Dadar. So you can visit our center also, and you can also visit our website, which is called the Man of Edu dot com. So let us start with the first question: uh, Which state launched in space tech framework and hosted the launch event on metaverse so correct answer is the telangana if we talk about the description you can see it over here telangana launched its space tech framework to promote domestic production of launch vehicles satellite systems and subsystems ground equipment manufacturing and other facilities it was also the first ever official government event to be hosted on metaverse a space tagged uh, themed metaverse environment was developed along with the avatars of key participants including the industries and it minister kt rama rao uh, niti ayog ceo amitabh kant and isro chairman somnath among others is it clear let us discuss the next question uh, which indian armed forces origin uh, organizes uh, the national level pollution response exercise nato pol rex so if we talk about the correct answer so correct answer is the indian coast guard so correct answer is the indian coast guard and if we talk about the description so the national level pollution response exercise it stands for the nato pol rex is being conducted by the indian coast guard of murmugao harbor in the goa union defense secretary ajay kumar inaugurated this particular event and the two day marine spill preparedness exercise over here and over 85 participants from 15 agencies including observers from 22nd friendly or foreign countries and international organizations and two coast guard ships from sri lanka and bangladesh participate in this particular event okay let us discuss the next one uh, which company delivered the scorpion class submarine ins vagshri to the indian navy if we talk about the correct answer so our correct answer is the uh, magaza gon dog okay so let us discuss the description Uh, defense secretary ajay kumar launched ins vagshri the sixth scorpion class submarine under the project 75 it is named after the sand fish a predator of the indian ocean he megazon dock has already delivered four scorpion class submarine under the project to the indian navy ins kalavri ins khandri and ins karanj and ins vela okay if we talk about the fifth submarine vagir is under trial at the sea and is set to be commissioned before the end of this particular year okay let us discuss the next thing India's first pure green hydrogen power plant uh, has been commissioned in which state so if we talk about the correct answer so correct answer is the assam okay so the oil indian uh, limited oil commissioned india's first 99.999 uh, percent pure green hydrogen plant in the state of assam uh, oils the second largest national production and exploration firm commissioned the hi green hydrogen plant at its joharat pump station the plant has an installed capacity of producing 10 kg of hydrogen each day it is also india's first plant to use aem anion exchange membrane okay let us discuss the next question poison pill which was seen in the news is associated with which of the particular field so if we talk about the correct answer so correct answer is the acquisition of the company okay so if we talk about the description uh, in the field of finance related to merger and acquisition limited duration shareholders rights plan is also known as the poison pill okay recently in response to elon musk take over bid twitter has adopted poison pill which allows existing shareholders to purchase freshly issued shares in a company at a discount to the trading price this will in turn make boyot uh, plan extremely expensive and the complicated let us move on the next question urja pravah which was recently inducted 
inducted in the shape of uh, auxiliary barrage of which armed forces so if we talk about the correct answer so correct answer is the indian coast guard let us discuss the description the indian coast guard ship auxiliary barrage the named urja prabha uh, you can see this particular name over here okay uh, has been inducted into a indian coast guard at gujarat bharuch okay it will be under the operational command of coast guard district headquarters for kerala and mahe in addition to auxiliary barrage urja shota which was based here since 2017 the ship is 36 meters long and is designed to carry cargo ship fuel okay if we talk about this particular one so that is our aviation fuel and the fresh water okay let us discuss the next one uh, india out campaign is associated with which country if we talk about the correct answer so correct answer is the maldives okay so let us discuss the description maldivian president abraham mohammad soli issued an order banning the indian out campaign led by former president yamin the campaign uh, accuses the Maldivian government of following Indian military presence in the island nation president soli has opted for an india first foreign policy the maldives national security council announced its decision that the campaign to incite hatred against india is a threat uh, to national security okay let us discuss the next one Emmanuel uh, macron has won the presidential election of which of the following countries so correct answer is the france So, if we talk about the descriptions, Alam uh, Emmanuel Macron has won the presidential election of France. Uh, Amnesty historical challenge from four uh, right candidate Marine Le Pen. Uh, Macron become the first French leader to be really re-elected to the office in two twenty years. The historic election were keenly noted as it could have shattered Western alliance against Russia and jeopardizing the survival of the European Union. Okay, let us move on to the next question. Kuril Islands, which was seen in the news, is claimed by which countries? So if we talk about the correct answer, so correct answer is the Japan and Russia. Okay. Uh, ever since the Soviet Union conquered the Kuril Islands in 1945, the ownership has been challenged by Japan. In the latest version of the 2022 Diplomatic Blue Book, uh, which was published by the Japanese Ministry of Foreign Affairs, the Northern Territories are islands over which Japan has sovereignty, but now are illegally. Occupied by the Russia. Let us discuss this particular map over here. So you can see this map over here. That is a Russia. That is a Japan, and that is a particular island which is known as the Kuril Island. Okay. Let us move on this next question. Which billionaire uh, has struck a deal to buy the global microblogging platform Twitter? So if we talk about the correct answer, so correct answer is the Elon Musk. So let us discuss the description. Uh, the board of top microblogging company Twitter has agreed to a USD 44 billion takeover of offer from the billionaire Elon Musk. Elon Musk is the world's richest person according to Forbes magazine with an estimated net worth of USD 273.60 billion. He runs the electric vehicle maker Tesla and the aerospace firm SpaceX. Okay, so let us move on the next question. Which is the venue of Asia's biggest international food and hospitality hospitality fair, Ahar 2022? If we talk about the correct answer, so correct answer is in the New Delhi. Okay, let us discuss the description. Uh, Agriculture and process uh, process food products export development authority (APEDA) in association with the India Trade Promotion Organisation (ITPO) is organizing Asia's biggest international food and hospitality fair, Ahar 2022. The fair is being organized at Pragati Maidan in New Delhi as per the commerce and industry minister more than 80 exporters from different segments of agriculture products will participate in the fair AP EDA uh, has created stalls for exporters from northeast region in Himalayan states women entrepreneurs FPOs startups and exporters of a uh, millions okay let us move on the next question uh digital india risc file uh microprocessor di dir program aims to create microprocessor and achieve silicon and design wins by which of the following years so if we talk about the correct answer so correct answer is the 2030 okay let us discuss the uh, description The Ministry of Electronics and IT launched the Digital India RISC Microprocessor (DIR) program. Uh, it aims to enable creation of microprocessor and achieve industry-grade uh, silicon and design wins by December 2023. It also set milestones for commercial silicon of Shakti and Vega and the design wins by December 2023. Okay. 
Deer will see partnerships with the startups, academia, and multinationals to make India uh, RISCV talent hub for the world as well as supplier of RISCV SOC system on chips for server, ser uh, servers, mobile devices, automotive, and IoT and microcontrollers. Okay, let us move on the next question. Uh, Quar hydroelectric project which was seen in news uh, is located in which of the following state or UT? So if we talk about the correct answer, so correct answer is the Sikkim. Okay, so the cabinet uh, on a uh, sorry uh, correct answer is the Jammu and Kashmir. Okay, please remember it. Uh, the cabinet committee on Elect uh, economic affairs approved the investment of rupees uh, four five twenty six point twelve crores of for the four five four zero megawatt Quar. Uh, hydroelectric project. It is located on Chenab River in Jammu and Kashmir. Kids were uh, discussed. The Kavar Hydro project will be implemented by Chenab Valley Power Projects Private Limited (CVPPL). Okay, a joint venture company between NHPC Limited and Jammu Kashmir State Power Development Corporation (JKSPDC). So you can please correct it. The correct answer is the Jammu and Kashmir (J and K). Please correct it, not the Sikkim. Okay, correct answer is the Jammu and Kashmir. Let us discuss the next question. India has recently opened its new mission in which of the following European countries. So, if we talk about the correct answer, so correct answer is the Lithuania. Uh, the Union Cabinet approved a proposal to open a new Indian mission in Lithuania in 2022 to depend political relations and strategic cooperation and enable growth of bilateral trade with the Baltic country. The decision to open an embassy in Lithuania is a part of the government's pursuit of its uh, national priority of growth and development or SAPCA, Sat SAPCA Vikas initiative. India's diplomatic presence in Lithuania will provide market access for companies and improve exports of goods and the services. Okay, Let us move on the next question. Uh, which is the first airline in Asia to use Gagan satellite based navigation system during landing? So, if we talk about the correct answer, so correct answer is the Indigo. Uh, Indigo become the first airline in Asia to use the indigenously developed satellite based navigation system Gagan during landing. The system has been jointly developed by the airport authority of India, AAI and Indian Space Research Organization. It provides corrections to the global positioning system GPS signal to improve air traffic management with the help of reference and uplink stations. Okay, So, let us discuss this particular image over here. Uh, India master control center over here and that is a particular users uh, which is in the aeroplane and if we talk about this particular satellite, so satellites guide this particular aircraft regarding the landing. So, that is it for the today's session. Uh, before we go going to complete this session, I want to discuss that if you are preparing for the low entrance, ambient entrance, this examination and if you are also preparing for government bank examination, BBA, hotel management, B8, NSCGL. So, do not worry, whenever education is here and if you are interested for this kind of the courses, so, Google form link is available in the description where you can fill the form very easily as per your recommend and our counseling team will contact you and will definitely guide you. If you are the new family member of the Manever Education, so please subscribe our channel in the YouTube. We have also social media platform where you can get the regular updates. If you are looking for the online and live classroom coaching, so just contact on 8828581455. If you are looking for classroom coaching at the Mumbai, so we have three centers, Borivali, Vasa and Didadar. So, you can visit our center also and you can also visit our website which is called the manoveredu.com. Okay. So, that's it for the today's session uh, once again i want to tell you that if you are interested for this kind of the video so please like these videos for the future reference and if you are really appreciate this particular session so please share this session with your friends family members and colleagues who are preparing for this particular examinations and competitive examination over here so that's it for the today's session once again thank you jahin bye bye and always welcome